Let's act like uh, the last... <laughs> the last 20 minutes of this game didn't happen. Uh, you didn't miss much, but... Oh boy. My computer does not like this game, apparently. And the last time I was playing it, it crashed. So... Here's hoping you really didn't miss much. But you didn't, by the way. Um, we explored this area. So there's that. There's this cool stuff up here, yeah? Except not really. I got a new shot. Isn't that cool and completely explained? Yeah. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna go through the trouble of, uh, talking too hard about it. I like how the one time I come up with something interesting to say, the game crashes. Well, not even just the game. My computer crashed. It's one thing if the game crashes. I had enough of that in Celeste that I know that I at least get my... But instead, the computer crashed, and I didn't get my recording. I got a corrupted file. So that's fun. Except for the part that it wasn't very fun. And I didn't get to, uh... I didn't get to keep my recording. So that's, that's cool. That sucks, though. Anyways. So... Instead... Um... I'm just not going to explain anything, and I'm going to put a funny JoJo reference at the start of the video. And that definitely is going to be a productive use of my time. And also, hey look, we can do this now. Isn't that cool? Is that really only health? That's all I can do there? Okay. So... I'm going to talk a bit about what we were talking about, but not before... We get to see a cool cutscene, I think. Unless that's not over here and I'm wrong. It's not over here. I'm wrong. Cool. I think the cutscene's not gonna play. That's alright. You didn't miss much. We'll see the cool guy again later. And by again, I mean for the first time, in everybody else's case. Because... You didn't see the cool guy to begin with. Is that gonna break? No, it's not. Of course it's not gonna break. Huh, well... In that case, I guess I can talk about the fun things I was talking about on the episode that ended up getting deleted. And by deleted, I mean... Corrupted file... A broken computer. Uh, all the fun stuff. So basically, right, I uh, was thinking, I was doing some, some big brain thinking about um, the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the Calvinist view of predestination and how interesting it is. <laughs> and um, my basic thought process on it is that, cool, I came here for no reason at all. I find it to be uh, kind of funny, just on the basis of, uh, I'm not sure there's too much point to the thought itself, because it's either, in my mind, it's either uh, kind of a, an exercise in futility. Or it's almost entirely meaningless to begin with. And uh, the way I think about it is that um, <laughs> it's like the probably the stupidest thing I've talked about in my channel. Because uh, here's hoping that that's not visible, huh? I still don't know if the Steam HUD is visible when I'm in game. Probably, but you know. Um, screw that guy, you know, I can't do that, but basically my thoughts are thus, uh, the, the, the principles by which we're created by God within Christianity is that, uh, there's free will, yeah, but, um, 
and then you're tempted to do not good things. I'm saying this in the stupidest, most dumbed down way possible, and I don't even, I'm not even entirely sure why. Do I even have enough to make any of the other things? Probably not. Um, that's, that's kind of all. And then, it's, you can't, there's a whole deal where your god doesn't allow you to be tempted beyond your means. And that's where I get kind of into like a tizzy about predestination. But I'm kind of wondering about it in that if you don't know, predestination is the idea that, um, uh, basically at the moment of conception, whether or not you end up in heaven or hell is determined. And I guess the thought there is the specificity of the word determined in that is it that it's decided for you or that it is known because if you have an all-knowing god then it's kind of a it's it's just like well of course you would know so it's it's weird that you would have a word for it if that is actually all that it is, then sure. But the flip side of it is the idea that you're maybe not fully able to have control over where you end up. And that seems to contradict somewhat with what I was talking about earlier in terms of, um, you know what, I shouldn't have done that yet because I'm gonna have to come through here. Okay, cool. All right. And I don't, I don't know if it's really like specifically contradiction so much as it doesn't seem to fit within the idea of you don't. Okay. I'm an idiot. Um, you're not tempted beyond your means. Things like that. Um, and it also gets a bit into kind of an interesting prescience kind of thing in that, um, well that's, that's a whole other deal. I was going to start talking about the, the way that I view future sight and crap like that. Um, who the heck is this guy? Oh, these woes, sigh. I shall not be your little play toy. They are forcing me into a dreadful existence. Everyone is out to torment me. Okay, pal. Oh, jeez. The woes of the white man. What? Well, I don't care. Anyways. I like how I'm going to start talking about predestination. I'm probably going to name this video after the white man. <laughs> Her name's Robin. Anyways, I'm royal. Wow. You a mechanic? I've got a bomb! I don't actually have a bomb. Did you come here looking for me? Uh, no. It's good, I guess. I'm not going anywhere. Treat me like a bird that has to do things. I'm my own man. Oh, he summoned the flowers. How about that? Can't seem to recreate some flowers, though. Oh. What in the heck? That is a big finish. Sheesh. No, I don't know who you are. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I would hope you didn't make that. Oh, that is not a flower. Expunge. It's a pirate machine, of course. I'm supposed to get it near where he's concentrating. Okay, I see. I see what he's saying now. Holy jeez. 
Oh, okay, this is kind of BS. I don't remember it being as stupid as this last time. Okay, never mind. That is way less stupid. It's actually still stupid, but like... Holy... I have to use it- I have to use this gun. It would have been interesting to know that. And, but okay. Um... But... That's the way that I think about... Christian Predestination. <laughs> Even though it doesn't really apply to me directly. As I'm not a Calvinist. I just find it interesting. You know? So... There's that. How about it? And I was thinking a little bit about, um... Things that I could do that might be interesting. Where, like... I don't have much to talk about all that often. You can probably tell by the fact that I've just spent however long talking about the Protestant predestination. Maybe. That might be that might be a bit of a tell. Just maybe. Seriously, I really should be able to get away. I do wonder if Okay, fine, I can. Holy god. Actually, does this have a charge shot? I think so. That's a wacky one. That's a wacky boss. That's, uh, okay. There it goes. Uh. I don't think I did a good job explaining the way that I... The way that I, uh... Not sure where you lost your escort, but I insist I shall take you instead. Otherwise, you can't return to camp. So don't go wandering off alone like this. Oh good, I now have another party member that I can't switch to because why would I be able to do that in a game with a party system? That's just kind of silly. Huh. Anyways. Um. Yeah, if you have anything you want me to talk about, I'll talk about it. Basically anything on the channel. I've been kind of veering from talking about, like, things that specifically interest me. Or things that I deem relevant. Because most of the things that I think about in that way are not things that I want to be the one that brings up, you know? Or not so much that as just I don't really have too many unique things to add to a lot of the things that I know about because I know about them through other people talking about them. So there's that, but I can sure say my piece about a lot of crap. <laughs> so if you would like me to talk about wacky things or if you just have anything at all you want me to talk about, please, dear God, comment. Because I'm running out of content. <laughs> I've, I've been saying that for years. Here I am. So yeah, that'll be all for today. Um, Iconoclast is such a good and interesting game. Till next time, like, comment, and subscribe. Or I will um, destroy you with Big Pirate Machine. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.